the top 10 most anticipated games of E3 2021. E3 2021 is almost here, and hopefully this is the last time it will be held virtually. The show has persevered through a global pandemic to transform into an all-digital event. But one thing that hasn't changed is that it's still the premier gaming event for the biggest game reveals and deep dives into our favorite franchises. This year will be no different, and so we present to you our picks for the biggest games and products to keep an eye on. Number 10. Avowed. When the developers of Fallout New Vegas announce a new RPG franchise, we sit up and take notice. That's the case with Avowed. Revealed around a year ago, it's Obsidian's take on Bethesda's Elder Scrolls template. While we don't expect to get a first chunk of gameplay footage, we do expect a new trailer and plenty of new info. With Bethesda focused on its new sci-fi franchise Starfield, there's an opening for Avowed to take the high fantasy action RPG crown. At least temporarily. Number 9. Final Fantasy 16. One of the biggest surprises at the PlayStation 5's coming out party was Final Fantasy 16. It's been almost five years since Final Fantasy 15 was released, so maybe we shouldn't be shocked. But no one would have guessed the franchise would return to PlayStation exclusivity. It appears to be a bit of a throwback to the PS1 and PS2 era with a more traditional fantasy setting, and rumors are swirling it could release later this year. E3 2021 should provide plenty of insight into the next entry in Square Enix's biggest franchise. Number 8. Fable 4. Ever since Peter Molyneux stated that you could plant a seed and watch a tree grow in the original Fable, we've been waiting for the franchise to reach its full potential. It hasn't happened to this point, but perhaps the power of Xbox Series consoles and a new developer are just what the doctor ordered. Are we a little concerned that a studio most known for driving games is tackling the project? Absolutely, but that just builds the intrigue for its big coming out party at E3 2021. Number 7. Halo Infinite. It could be argued that there's no more important release in 2021 than Halo Infinite. The last two games in the series were solid, but unspectacular. Microsoft needs this game to be excellent, to continue the impressive momentum of its new series consoles and Game Pass. Reactions to the first single-player gameplay weren't especially kind, so it also needs to rebuild that trust while debuting its multiplayer offerings for the very first time. One of the industry's biggest franchise lies in the balance, and we can't wait to see Microsoft's saving throw. Number 6. Pokemon Legends Arceus. The dream of every Pokemon fan for the last 15 years has been an open world game in the vein of every other modern RPG. That's exactly what we're getting with Pokemon Legends Arceus. You can't move an analog stick without bumping into a Pokemon clone these days, and some of them go far beyond what Nintendo and Game Freak are currently offering. It's a put up or shut up moment for the franchise. We expect a huge gameplay blowout courtesy of Nintendo's Treehouse, which should put all questions to rest. Number 5. Elden Ring. We've included Elden Ring in a lot of our most anticipated lists over the last couple years, but it appears the ship is finally sailing into the harbor. After a glut of footage and information leaks over the last half year, it's hard to imagine that we won't finally get an in-depth look at From Software's new IP being created in conjunction with Game of Thrones' George R.R. R. Martin. Initial leaks appear to show it's an open-world action RPG that even includes mounts, which should be a huge step forward for Dark Souls fans thirsty for their next fix. Number 4. Metroid Prime 4. The original Metroid Prime is still one of the highest reviewed video games ever. It seamlessly brings the complicated world of Samus Aran into the third dimension and establishes a new paradigm for atmosphere and isolation in video games. It's now been four years since Metroid Prime 4 was announced. It initially started development at Bandai Namco, but it's since returned to its parents at Retro Studios. The Switch happened over two years ago, so we're primed for the game's first official blowout. Number 3. Starfield. While we patiently wait for The Elder Scrolls 6, Bethesda has been hard at work on its new sci-fi RPG franchise, Starfield. 
While it's lazy to describe it as Skyrim in space, that generalization probably isn't too far off the mark. The studio has been extremely tight with any information or footage, but that should all change at E3 2021. Number two. The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild 2. The first Breath of the Wild is still considered one of the greatest video games ever made. Its twists on the open world action RPG have been mercilessly copied ever since. But it's time for the king to retake the throne at E3 2021. It's been a long four years waiting for the sequel. It's also the 35th anniversary of the franchise, and we expect Nintendo to throw quite the party with a new trailer and extensive gameplay demos from its treehouse group. Number one. Nintendo Switch Pro. New hardware is always a big story at E3, and according to extremely reliable sources, an upgraded version of Nintendo Switch is about to be unveiled. Reporting from Bloomberg indicates it's a 4K capable machine when docked, and its handheld component includes a new OLED screen at a higher resolution and size. Switch is Nintendo's most successful console since the Super Nintendo, and this hardware revision should build on its legend, making it our most anticipated product at E3 2021. Thanks for checking out our rundown of things to keep an eye on at E3 2021. We'll be covering the show with live commentary and analysis of all the big press events. So head on over to patreon.com slash sifted and drop us a pledge to get all the latest. You should also visit our E3 hub at sifted.net for all the hottest trailers, debuts, and gameplay, sortable by over 60 categories to find just what you want as quickly as possible. There's simply no site better for E3 coverage than Sifted. See you during the show.